Five, four, three, two, one, boom. What's up, champions? Coach Real here with my beautiful wife, Coach Michelle, and it's Tone with Real, the two minute workout, get in shape during commercial breaks. I'm always an advocate. I don't want you to have any excuses. No gym necessary, no equipment necessary. All you gotta do is have a desire to show up and take action. So today, we're gonna give you three exercises. We're gonna give you one for your arms, we're gonna give you one for your stomach, keep that nice flat stomach, and we're gonna give you one for your bootay, as your <laughs> wife, as my wife likes to call them. So what did you call the arm exercise? Well, today I thought maybe we should just simply show them how to do a push-up. Push-up, okay, and what are we gonna do with the stomach exercises? Crunch. Crunch, and our bootay exercise? Our bootay exercise is a pointed butt blaster. Pointed Point, not a butt blaster, but a pointed <laughs> butt blaster. Okay, and so basically, you know, you have options. My whole theme is like do it during commercial break so you can break it up in sets. So by the end of your show, you're gonna be in rock and shape. But you know, you can also break it down and do us one set of 100 of these for you advanced people, or you can break it down into 10 sets of 10, two sets of 50, you know, four sets of 25. However you wanna break it up, you can break it up. So let's take a look at the exercise. I'm gonna have my beautiful, amazing fitness model, Michelle here, my smoking hot wife, will be demonstrating the exercises for us. In a little while. Okay, so let's take a look, here we go. All right, so as you see, Michelle's doing a push up. What I like to do a lot of times, go all the way down to the ground, Michelle, relax, release, push up, release, put your hands down, tense the stomach, flex the booty, and make your body tight, just drive your hands down and push yourself up, all the way up, go all the way back down and release. That's what we call a push-up release, and I've been coaching people for years. Whether you've never done a push-up before, you can always do this one. So go ahead one more time. Tight body, push yourself all the way up and all the way back down. Now, another option is you could do it on your knees if you're beginning. Just same thing, push yourself up. Keep the body straight though, right? Nice, we don't want to do no bananas and all the way up. That is your push-up exercise, just like that, okay? Perfect. Okay, this exercise is your crunch, okay? Once again, with the crunch, what we want to do, if you almost pretend like you got a softball between your chin and your chest, show them where that would be, honey. You show them where the softball would be, right there, yeah. Good, and, don't, and then keep your chin up, look up to the sky, and crunch up. There you go, good. And all the way back down, keep the stomach tight, pull the abs in, little pulses, just like that. Boom, that's it, just like that. Little pulses you can do. You can go all the way down, all the way up. The key to ab exercises is to pull that belly button through the floor and keep tight the whole time. And there you go, that is your crunch. All right, this is the, not the butt blaster, but the pointed butt blaster. And you notice my wife, she has a nice, she's on her elbows, nice right angles right there, supporting her body. She's got a nice flat, um, with her back is nice and flat. She's got her leg in a right angle. Toe is pointed to the ceiling, let me show you. She's got a point right there like that. And you squeeze the butt and pulsate up towards the ceiling. Boom, just like that, tight, tight. And then you'll do that. And so if you're doing 100, you do 50 on one side, 50 on the other. Or if you're doing sets of 10, do five there, and then five to the other side right there. And there you go, perfect, boom. All right, champions, that was awesome. You did great. A couple things here. Some of you may say, well, I'm still struggling with the push-ups or something. Some of you wanted to say, you could start your push-ups, you know, even against the wall or, you know, if you've got a countertop. The key is just like when uh, Michelle was doing her push-ups, you just keep the body straight and suck that stomach in, squeeze the booty, and you can eventually, you start here on the wall, work yourself down to a countertop, work yourself down to a couch, the back of the couch, work yourself all the way down to the floor, then maybe you're starting on your knees, then you're going to a full extension from your toes and doing those push-up releases. I promise you, guys, I've been doing this for a long time. I love to do push-up releases because here's the deal. I promise you, you weigh what, 100, 200, 300 pounds, whatever you weigh. If you had 300 pounds on top of you and you needed to get that weight off you to go save your kids or your loved ones, you would push that off no problem. So even if we're just starting to, what I want you to know, even though we set the reps for 100, right? You know, don't get overwhelmed by that. Maybe for you today, you start with, you know, just five sets of one, right? And then tomorrow, next time you're doing push-ups, you're doing five sets of two and you're working yourself up, next thing you're doing five sets of 10, that's 50, you know? So we set the bar high because we've got beginners, intermediate, and advanced, right? Perfect. Good, all right, anything you wanna say? No, I love it. All right, have a great day, guys. We love you, we appreciate you, and we'll believe in you till you believe in yourself, make the rest of the day the best of the day. God bless. Boom. Boom.